Here we are presenting our CVPR 2021 paper, Deep I2P, Image Point Cloud Registration Vault Deep Classification. Our presentation consists of six parts. The third part, Frosten Classification, and the fourth part, Inverse Camera Projection, are the major components of our approach. The problem we are solving is cross-modality registration, specifically Given a RGB image and a 3D point cloud, can we estimate the relative pose between the camera and the point cloud reference frame? The problem is difficult because the nature of two data sources are quite different. RGB image is dense with 2D color information, while 3D point cloud is sparse point set without textures. Cross-modality registration enables previously impossible applications, for example, mapping with LiDAR, and localization with low-cost cameras. Although there are lots of existing works for same modality registration, there is very few methods for cross-modality registration. To the best of knowledge, the 2D-3D MeshNet is the only prior work targeting for general image to point cloud registration. Our deep I2P circumvents the challenging needs to learn cross-model feature descriptor for registration by casting the problem into a two-stage classification and optimization framework. Our idea is shown on the right figure. The intuition is simple. The camera projection model is well known. Given the relative pose, we can easily figure out whether a point falls in the image plane or not. But can we do the inverse? That is, if we know whether a 3D point falls in the image plane or not, can we solve the relative pose between the point cloud and the camera? This question further breaks down to two problems. First, given the point cloud a RGB image, how can we know whether a 3D point falls in the image plane or not? To solve it, we propose the Frosten classification using deep network. Second, assume we know whether a 3D point falls inside the image or not, how do we estimate the camera pose? To solve it, we propose the inverse camera projection solver using Gauss-Newton optimization. The Frosten classification is a typical per-point semantic segmentation problem. The inputs are a point cloud and an image. The output is binary classification for each 3D point in the point cloud. Label 1 means that particular 3D point falls inside the image plane. Label 0 means that point falls outside the image plane. Here is the training procedure. We require the ground truth relative pose between the point cloud and camera so that we can generate the per point label automatically without any annotation. With the Frosten classification, for each point, we know whether it falls in the image or not. Now we have to solve the second problem. How can we estimate the relative pose with that information? We formulate the problem into a traditional optimization problem. The cost function consists of two parts. Please refer to our paper for detailed explanation. After defining the cost function, the optimization can be done with classical Gauss-Newton method. Here the figures show the optimization process. The green points represent prediction of 1, while green points represent prediction 0. Initially, the camera frosting is not aligned with the green predictions. During the optimization, the solver gradually aligns the camera frosting with the green points by optimizing the rotation and translation parameters. We perform experiments on Oxford Robocar and KD dataset. We compare our results with the existing work 2D, 3D matchnet and some other baselines using state-of-the-art approaches. Ablation studies are presented to verify our design choices. Our codes are open sourced, although the cross-modality registration is not that accurate for now. There are potentials to improve it. For example, utilizing multiple cameras, training more powerful networks, and fine-grained semantic segmentation. That's all for our presentation. Thank you.